Hey guys, I'm so sorry. Okay, part two, I don't know what happened, but I lost you guys, but it was really a blessing because uh, this is a really complicated file when you wanna use four colors because if they're layered on top of each other in any way, you have to be, hey Heather, you have to be um, really careful about what you're doing. So I was like, you know what, I'm gonna go ahead, finish cutting and weeding this and get back on and show you guys, I didn't mean to end it, but it really worked out because I had to go through it in my mind and show you guys what I'm doing. So I'm sorry about that. I'm still gonna give you that coupon. I'll go ahead and tell you right now. Um, <laughs> hey Tara, yes, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. Um, the coupon is gonna be for solid vinyl today. It's a really good one. So hang on, I'll give that to you. Um, and I'm really sorry about the technical issues. But um, I wanna show you this, what I had to do and how I'm thinking through this process. Because if you guys are brave and wanna do four colors or mix it all up like this on this file, you're going to have to be careful as you um, layer them, okay? So thank you, Tara. I love it too, I love it. And I'm on the regular live right now. I didn't do the switcher studio so that we wouldn't have that issue again. And so I'm gonna turn you guys around so you can see what's going on over here. Okay, so on this, we have lots of different parts, okay? On this, I, I remember we cannot layer on top of the glitter. And so we need to make sure that we're careful about that. Plus this pompon is at the very bottom. I mean, yeah, is at the very bottom of the layers. So those two needed to be done first. So I'm just gonna go ahead uh, you know what, hopefully it'll just do. My, my collar's on there, but we're gonna just go ahead and press it for a second. And I am just praying I don't mess this up. So you guys just say a little prayer for me because I was like, oh my gosh, this is really, really involved. But when it's finished, it's going to look amazing. So now we have that pom-pom. We need to add in our black one, our bigger one. So this one is gonna go over here and it kind of overlaps this little guy. But I also wanna go ahead and remember we have the glitter for the top of the football and we have an offset. So our offset obviously is gonna have to go on first, but I wanna make sure that it's lined up. And earlier that didn't cut because I didn't have it on cut edge and you can see now there's still a little line right there which is really gonna help me And this because I can just line it up where it needs to be because you see how all of these layer on top of one another. So it would be a mess if I didn't get it just right. So let's see if we can do it. I obviously can't press it like this, so you don't wanna press it like this, but I'm just making sure that my solids are going to be where they need to be, okay? So this is the second layer. Whew, lots of layers, but it's gonna be cute. It's gonna be worth it. Now we obviously need our Teflon for this one because our HTV is exposed now and I'll move that collar off in a minute. If it doesn't give it a good press, we'll press it really good at the end and make sure that it's not gonna be um, messed up. So you guys know that I don't have a super great track record on live with doing layering. And why I thought I was going to do this without trying it first for you guys, I do not know. Oh, good grief. Oh, good grief, guys. See, and I knew I put it on top. Okay, all right, no problem. Uh, okay, you guys have to see my face. I mean, is it Monday? Is it Monday? So you can see where that would be a problem. Um, I'm going to take this off. I'm so bummed, guys. Really, really bummed. Let's see if I can save it while it's still warm. Probably not, but we're gonna just be, be positive and hopefully we can and then Well, you know what, Tara, Tara, uh, Tara's kids go to the same school that my kids go to. And so it's really good that her kids, uh, that I'm not doing this in the right colors because tonight I was gonna do one in our colors. And here, let's see, we turn you guys around so you can see. Okay, do you wanna see what happened? Let me show you what happened. So whenever I pressed this, I wasn't being careful. I was sitting there talking about how careful I needed to be. And instead of um, making sure that I did not make the wrong layering choice i'm trying to find my um transfer tape right now because i'm going to fix this this is not i i think that it probably we should just like start over but i'm not going to start over right here because i'm determined to finish this project we're just going to use this okay so basically i don't want to use high tack either give me a second guys okay 
So I'm going back, I'm, I just have my, my transfer tape. This is not gonna look great. So I would use VLR or I would try to get it off in some way. But right now, since it's the offset, I am just going to pray that um, you know we can work this out. And then I can see your comments in a second because I'm on the regular live. This is not gonna look just super beautiful. Maybe it will, maybe it will. Let's just see. You know, I really do try to be positive and no matter what, I think I stretched this A a little bit, but if I can get this layer down, I mean, this is uh, this will definitely go on record for probably the craziest project I've done on live as well as uh, many fails. Okay, so we're gonna layer that, or just go ahead and press it. Let's get that little wrinkle out. And okay, the only reason I am attempting this is because in a moment, I'm gonna put an offset on, I mean, a, the inside of it, this is just the offset. So I may can save it to where it won't look absolutely horrible. Okay, so let's see. At least it's entertaining, right guys? At least I give you that. <laughs> okay, let's press this and then we're gonna get that collar off on this next one because I know that's probably bothering you guys. Okay, so we have now somewhat saved our offset. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like, that it is not beautiful, but it's not horrible either. I did save it. I was just really careful and did it while it was warm to make sure to um, not stretch it as much as I could. I could avoid it, and, whew, man, I'm gonna need a nap after this, guys. Okay, so now we can line up our football. And remember, we left our heart where it was supposed to be. We're, we're gonna get to mom in just a moment. So we may be able to pull this off, guys. I really, really, really hope so. I'll turn this light up, see maybe you guys can see better. Okay, still using our Teflon. Lots and lots of layering here. But it's not gonna be thick because all of these are really thin. Um, besides the glitter, the glitter's not like super duper thin, but it's still gonna look really great. And yeah, it does. The offset, I'm a little off over here. I, I didn't do it, here, let me show you. I didn't line it up perfectly. I could have saved it a little bit more, but I didn't. But that's okay, it's still gonna be really good. This is gonna be a really good example shirt. How about that? Okay, <clears throat> now. Remember we have these little moms and I don't have anything overlapping here so it's not gonna, it's not gonna hurt anything, thank goodness. I don't know if I've ever had a successful overlapping. It got in between the carrier sheet basically. So if you get in between the carrier sheet, that is what is gonna happen. Now, um, the black is coming next with the little dots but we also don't wanna forget about our adorable Megaphone. <laughs> you guys are like, watch out, Mandy. Don't. So what I'm doing is I'm going to cut as close to that as I can so that I do not overlap because I do not want to overlap this at all. Actually, I am. Okay. If you saw the design, and maybe I need to go back and look at the design because the design isn't messed up. You just have to be really, really good at... Oops, you have to be really good at layering and making sure you put it in the right spot and really think it out. So that mega megaphone, I want to be right there. So I'm gonna pull this M off and do that in a moment, which is what I should have done up there. But I got too ahead of myself and probably a little too confident because I was like, I thought this out, I can totally do it. So pressing for another few seconds. It never needs a lot, remember. And we are almost done, literally. Well, there's two more presses, but still almost done. Now I'm just trying to make sure that I'm lining that up with that so it's not crooked. And I'm gonna do this one. And then the black M's, the inside of the M's and the dots will go next. I have a little line right there and that's why you wanna do quick tacks so you don't get that little line and you can pull that carrier sheet off ASAP. And mom. Okay, so this would, I would say, if you really wanna challenge yourself, do four different uh, colors and um, try to layer them all because it's gonna be really, really great practice for you. You can slide this in carefully, of course, making sure not to overlap anything. And I know I'm making you guys nervous, but don't be nervous because it's gonna work out just 
perfectly. Okay, let me think this through. Okay, so the dots are touching my shirt. That, okay, that should work. I, even if I have to talk to myself, we're gonna get this done, guys. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, that is awesome. Okay, now see how, much, how worth it was, guys. See how cute that is? Definitely a lot of layering, um, but it is really, really cute. And think about it, you're gonna wear this shirt every um, football game day, so it's perfect. Um, all that work is okay, because you're gonna wear it a lot. It's gonna be super duper, duper duper cute. I'm gonna pull it back. And if you guys hung, on, hung out with me to watch this be done, I love you so incredibly much, because that is not an easy feat to watch me struggle through something like this, but it looks really good. You can see I saved my offset up there. I'm happy I don't have to redo the shirt. Um, look how cute though, oh my goodness. Okay, let me turn you guys around so I can the coupon that you've totally earned. Okay, so since we're making a lot of sport shirts right now, I thought it would be fun to do a, um, a, a Caesar slash stalls sale so you guys can get those shirts made if you wanted to use your team colors. Um, we do have patterns that we've been working on for team colors as well, so those are coming soon. But meanwhile, you're gonna get a coupon. That's really cute. You're gonna get a coupon. It's for 15% off solid colors. This is the kicker. It's only for today, so you must use it today. No ifs, ands, or buts. Um, it's that's on. That's gonna be on all solid. Okay. So um, the coupon code is gonna be solid. One five, so solid 15. So um, make your orders today, throw some pattern in there. You need to throw some pattern in there because it's not every day that we make just, you know, these, well, this isn't really a plain Jane shirt and you saw how much, it was a lot of, it was, it was a struggle. Thank you, Debbie, I am. Um, because believe me, I was like, when the, when the live ended earlier, I was like, I don't even, I, I'm like, I don't even, I need to, like, I, seriously, this is a big project, and I didn't even think it all the way through before we started cutting it this morning. So, for you guys, um, it could be a little bigger, too. You guys could go a little bigger. I don't know. It's kind of perfect. I like it. Um, so, I hope that you guys, I can't wait to see all the different variants that you do with this, and if you want to move those elements around so you don't have to stack them on top of each other, or do knockouts, you could do knockouts, do it, I'm okay with that, um, because I don't want you to cry like I almost did. Oh, and this is on a Goodfellow shirt. You know, I love the Goodfellow shirts from uh, the men's department. So there you go. I hope you loved it. Thank you for joining me this morning. I know that it was crazy, but um, it was fun. And this was a really cool one too, right? So solid one five, solid 15 is your code today to use on the website. Go do that, get you some solid stock up, okay? Bye guys, y'all have a great Friday.